and all of this super interlinked machine will help you uh, with the rankings. And again, all of this is totally free to create. So Google Sites, I want to talk about them for a bit. This is a Google site. It's totally free to create. And this is an example. And here's another example. This one uh, I own, so I can, I can manage and edit. But as you can see, it has my keywords, images, a bunch of uh, text regarding the, the business with the keywords included, of course. Then it has a map embed with the driving directions. This is also clickable, uh, which I can do if I view the published site. So this is fully uh, interactive. You can click and you can see all of these. I'll try to show you here if I can. You can see all these uh, maps have all of my websites, the citations, the name, address and phone number. Uh, but we have a video on uh, custom maps, so yeah, we'll go into this later on. But we, if you scroll down, we can see even more uh, articles and text, the name, address, and phone number again. Again, keyword optimized, they're bolded out here. You can do it. You can do that if you want. Then uh, we have a uh, Word document here uh, embedded again with all of our citations. As you can see here, social medias, again, links to our website. Then this was a, a map embed from Harvard. This one is no longer work. Then we have a video embed, then we have all of our social media here, and then we also link to the Google Slides. And I'll show you all of this in just a second. Uh, we also have our posts here embedded with all of the videos, again, more links. Then we have a slide presentation here, which has links inside of it, and all of our social media as well. Then we have, this is a Google drawing, if I'm not mistaken, or a Google Doc. Oh, it's a drawing, okay which has clickable links, or they used to be clickable at least. But uh, I'm talking too much. The idea here is that you can, with this Google Sites, which are free to create, just go to sites.google.com and you can create a free site. It's totally free to create for your business. You have templates as well. And what you do with this, you can customize it however you want. So you can put your uh, business name here. Sorry. And then you can build out something like this. And something or something like this this one as well has images here embedded it has of course the business name it has the, it has the keyword uh scatter scattered all around here as you can see this links to the website um here it's missing the the final e um it has all of this which i can go into for example these are images uploaded to google with the uh name of uh, what the business is or the actual image then we have and Google Sheets, which has a Google folder, folder sorry, with all of these uh, Google stacking inside of it. So all the properties are here. So the form, the drawings, the docs, as you can see here. Let me show you a couple more. So um, this uh, slide presentation should be also uh, in here in this uh, Google Doc. Yeah, it's right here, this slide presentation. So again, it's something similar to uh, this one down here uh down here sorry where was it yeah this one right here so this is the same same sort of thing this is the slide present presentation and what do you want to do so you want to create a google site so let me just do a quick diagram here you want to create a create a free google site okay just by going here to a sites.google.com and creating the site but you don't you don't just want to do um business name add an image and then uh you don't don't just want to do uh write stuff about your business here and a link to the site this is the bare minimum you can do with a google site what you want to do is use all of google's properties and interlink them between each other that's how you can get the most power out of these google sites and how you do that is using all the properties so this is your google site and then you have the Google Sheets. And then you have the Google Slides, the Google Docs. You have other citations, sorry, the Google Drawings, Docs and Drawings, the Google Forms. You have all of these Google properties that interlink between each other. And this is what's happening here. As you can see, we have the slides embedded, but the slides also link out to the... Um, Google Sites. So all of this is interlinked. 
And here's a diagram that explains it better. Basically, this is your money site and you have your Google site, which is on a Google Drive, of course, with all of these uh, properties that Google owns interlinked between each other, the forms, the presentation, the PDFs, the docs, the drawings, the sheets, all of these pointing to your site and all of them interlinked between each other. And this is again what's happening here. This is, for example, a Google Sheets that has links to our social media, but then links again to the Google Sites, to the Google Slides, to the Google Docs. All of these are interlinking between each other. As you can see, this is another Google Docs, which links to the website, links to all of the other properties, social media, citations, and again, back to the Google Sites and back to the slides and all of that. And this again, is, it's the same thing. Basically, you're interlinking all of this together. And you also add map embeds and video embeds and anything you can add to make it look sort of like this is what you want to do. And again, these are free to create on sites.google.com. So this, sorry, this is your money site. Okay. This is your free Google site, which points to your money site. But then you have a bunch of Google's properties down here. You have the Google drawings, the Google documents, the Google slides, the Google forms, the Google sheets. And I think that's it. All of these interlink between each other. So all of these link to one another and back to each other. Okay. And the drawings can link to the slides and the slides can link to the, um, the sheets and the sheets can link to the, the forms and the forms can link to the drawing. All of these can interlink to each other. And then all of these are linked to your Google site. And of course, your Google site links to all of these. And then you can also include your citations. You can also include video embeds and map embeds, which you include here in your Google sites as well. Of course, your citations can uh, link to your G Google Sites and your Google Sites can also link to your GMB. Sorry, this is the other way around. So basically your Google Sites will have the map embed and the video embed. And again, the video embed will link to YouTube, which in turn will link to your money site and the map embed will link to your GMB, which is great, which in turn eventually will link to your money site. And all of this super interlinked machine will help you uh, with the rankings. And again, all of this is totally free to create. Of course, if you want to pay someone to create something, something like this for free for you, just go to uh, connect.co forward slash stacking and you'll be able to get some for free. So I just want to record this quick video to let you know uh, that you should build out this um, Google Sites because it gives you a relevancy and it gives you trust amongst Google because this is a Google property. So you want to make sure you build out all of Google's properties. And that's basically it. I'll see you in the next video.